for one final time. Welcome to the climax of Euro 2000. Dennis Bergkamp and Patrick Kluivert lead the race towards the golden boot with Nuno Gomes for Portugal in close pursuit. Portugal versus Holland in Rotterdam shall be the curtain call to the first international tournament of the millennium. We touch down in the Oval Amphitheatre in the Fire North district of Rotterdam for the Euro 2000 final between the hosts of the upcoming European Championships in four years time as well as the current co-hosts, the Netherlands. From the very outset this summer, both teams have entertained enticingly, performed favourably. Both countries overcoming adversity, competing to draws in their opening games and then emphatically sweeping aside competitions such as Germany and France respectively. Portugal battering the European champions, the Netherlands dispatching the world champions in the group stages. For Portugal, Sergio Conceição will take the place of João Pinto. The two Paulos in midfield, Sousa and Bento respectively. As Costinha will bow out, Roy Costa on three goals, the same as Nuno Gomes. For the Dutch, it's largely an unchanged side that saw them well throughout the tournament. Patrick Kluivert on his own up front with three goals. He is supported by the top goal scorer, Dennis Bergkamp. It is the first of a 2000s trilogy between Portugal and the Netherlands in the Euro 2000 final. Now it seems the Dutch will be caught on the back foot as Conceição with a stylish through pass seeking out Figo. He's picked out Nuno Gomes. 1 0. It's taken just over five minutes. We have our opening goal in the Euro 2000 final. It's Nuno Gomes with goal number four. Nuno Gomes levels with Patrick Kluivert and leaves. The Dutch support is silent in their own final. The co-hosts, the Orange Carnival, has been gatecrashed by Benfica's baby-faced assassin. Zenden has an idea for Edgar Davids. Slams on the brakes, he's trying to find Burkamp at the far post. But telepathy tipped down the drain by Nuno Gomez on the D of the penalty area. Van der Sar deprives him of the honour of a comfortable beginning to their first ever appearance in the tournament final. First corner of the game. Swept away by Overmars. Sousa on the volley. Oh, it's startled Van der Sar. And Edgar Davids gets tied up with Nuno Gomez. Questionable goalkeeping from Van der Sar. Well, he's been excused by the offside flag. A seemingly nothing shot from Paolo Sousa. Perhaps spotted late by the shot stopper. Edgar Davids, none the wiser either, puts his body on line to stop Nuno Gomez getting that brace. It's arms and an entanglement with Nuno Gomez. Xavier comes to back him up. All they can claim from it is the side netting. Okay. It's Davids. He's pinged over the top, seeking out Zenden. Zenden's cross shut down. Cleared away by Jorge Costa. Here's Patrick Kleiber. Laid off to the reinforcements in Edgar Davids. Goal! Game on here! 30 minutes in. Edgar Davids gets his first goal of the Euros. It was Dimas Teixeira who gets the first block. Jorge Costa on the second clearance. Gets as far as Patrick Kluivert. The goggle-bearing pit bull, Edgar David. Disgraced from Euro 96. And sent home in shame. Has redeemed himself four years later. By bringing the co-hosts back into the final. And giving the Netherlands a fresh start. Against an electric Portugal side. Sent long by Sosa. It's Paulo Bento. Costa, he's just squeezed past an orange bearing defense. 
And Roy Costa has sought out goal number four and reverted Portugal back into the lead here in Rotterdam. The back heel backfired and resulted in an accidental assist before it's lumped past Edwin van der Sar. Ten minutes to go until half time. The Portuguese are back in front. Over Mars, clumsy touch from here. Although the real dispute is did the Dutchman earn a penalty? Abel Xavier brings him down. Xavier squares to Roy Costa. It's Sousa. First time smack, stinging the hands of Edwin van der Sar. Great save. The Dutch could find themselves in deeper trouble if Portugal capitalised on this corner five minutes ago and a miserable attempt at an interception from Fernando Couto. Clive giving Couto a run for his Escudo and Bergkamp demonstrates the Dennis system you offered in Evelyn's value with a touch of elegance. The co-hosts enter the Fakar. It's Fernando Couto failing to intercept the clearance from the Dutch and it's a counter-attack of death and Dennis Bergkamp gets goal number six. The golden boot is in the palms of his hands if the European Championship doesn't reach them as well. A roller coaster of a first half in Rotterdam. Portugal 2, Netherlands 2. Galeron, extra barrier, pushes the pass through to Raul, and Raul shows off his footwork, brings it upon himself to take matters into his own hands. He provided the goal for his eye, and is rewarded with a strike of his own at Euro 2000. It's a majestical finish from the royalty of Real Madrid. Yes, I know what I said was a misnomer. Zahovic. A give and go to Akimovic. It's a nice ball over the top. Zahovic gets there before the goalkeeper does. It's another rocket into the roof of the net from Slovenia. And they flip the game on his head. Zahovic beats Crouch to the punch. Costa follows up, he cuts inside for left shoot. Roy Costa catapults a fiery rock over the moat of the Romanian castle and Portugal have doubled their lead in time for half-time. A reputable rocket from Roy Costa. The ruiner of Romanian scoreboards. Two still layers wouldn't have stopped this. Magnificence from the man they call the Maestro. It's Alfonso. Here's Raul Gonzalez, the Prince of Madrid. It's still Raul, and the ball is glued to his feet. Yes, Raul finally releases the mercy of the ball into the bottom corner of the Slovenian goal. Spain level with the underdogs here in the Amsterdam Arena. Raul! Not Zinedine Zidane. Julian Sharan collects it out wide. Jokayev. Cross into an unmarked on me. Volleyed into the ground and back up into the skin of the goal net. Over three minutes since the restart in France. Have the start. Clinical finish from Henri. Repka is just one foot stomp away from blocking it. World champion. Totti. Albertini is awarded in favour of Zambota. Hits on the volley by Fiore. Oh, it's rolled through. It wasn't the cleanest connection, but it counts. Italy have a gigantic. 
Celtic two goal lead after just 10 minutes. It's maybe a long night for Sweden in Eindhoven. He's clipped it with the shins. But the damage is done. Stefano. There's Kleibert. Bill Koku, the captain, lines up with Bergkamp. The unlucky 13th minute for the French is Dennis Bergkamp with an uncharacteristic missile from the edge of the French base. The Dutch are daring to go at the world champions. In the game of teacher versus student is Dennis Bergkamp. He sets the example against the... Diego keeps the ball in play, prevents it from going over the line. Well, he affords the honour to Nuno Gomez, who takes it over the goal line. We have a kamikaze of a header against Turkey. Rush 2 didn't stand a chance. Two goals in one game for Nuno Gomez. Zidane's delivery on the French corner. The world champions are minutes away from an exit, but they remain for now. The king, Thierry Henry, with perhaps the goal of Euro 2000. The goal that keeps the world champions in the tournament. And after Peter Byers out of this world performance has taken a strike from out of this world to defeat him. It's a volley that comes out of the sky and towards the Portuguese turf like a comet. That'll shake. So it's up by the Seleschal. The counter-attack can commence. Nuno Gomez sends Luis Figo on his way, on his own. Luis Figo and Van der Sar closes him down. Did the Portuguese playmaker take too long to play it backwards to Nuno Gomez? Costinha. Arsusa wastes no time picking up Nuno Gomez. Is scooped up by Van der Sar. Just a fraction of a second sooner, and the circumstance completely flips on his head. It's a devious ball from Davids, ambitious as he picks out Overmars. Dennis Burkamp to the left hand side, Clybert and Overmars are waiting in the centre. And they're ignored completely by the Flying Dutchman. Dennis Burkamp goes for it alone. And Portugal's captain, Vita Baia, stands his ground. Dennis with the Dutch corner. Swung in, Overmars has dove in. He's gone! He's out! The Euro 2000 final is over for Overmars. Go for a goal by all means, but is this overkill from Overmars? He may have just killed the Dutch's hopes. Now they must contend this final with 10 men. Back and forth into play from Portugal. Figo. Bounds, Costinha at the far post, Costinha is blocked, shut down by Michael Reisiger. Not a bad recovery, and Michael Reisiger takes a tumble, springs on his feet to do his best bodyguard impression and stop Costinha. Second attempt at the corner from Bergkamp, it's a wonky clearance, Costinha trying to play it out, Roy Costa gets his feet tangled up. Suter, Costa. Oh, it's hold on and it's taken too early by Sharpinta. Temperature hotting up in Holland. Portugal applying more pressure to the Dutch. Here's Teixeira. The cross circles in and Roy Costa clips the shin. I would Dutch defender, I think it's coming for Van Bronckhorst. Three minutes to go. Here is Sal Pinto on the volley, trying to emulate Thierry Henry's goal against the Portuguese in the semi-final. It's washed all the way by Van der Sar this time. Here's David. Bergkamp. Only saw Sal Pinto for the far post. There's the chance. 
to win the final. A match winning goal. Dutch glory turned to dust and blown away by Bayer. Clarence Seydorf and the headlines of a hero. Dreamt about and destroyed in one second. Deja vu for both teams. It's going to be destiny for one and devastation for another. Extra time, 30 more minutes of your Euro 2000 final is about to begin. Held on to Figo. Returns to Paletta. Roy Costa is awaiting in the center. Here is Paletta. Are we twist and turns? The skate start. Oh, he's found the bottom corner. It's taken them three minutes to return to the top of the scoreboard. It's Portugal three. Netherlands two. And Paletta, the super sub, who's come on for Nuno Gomez, has more than justified Humberto Coelho's gamble. Here is Dennis Bergkamp screeching down. The right hand's flank and the cross is too heavy for Seidorf. Stands no chance of bringing this under control. Cross comes in from Figo. Paletta can't secure a brace. Here's George Costa. And it's scraped wide by Sharpinta. Five minutes remaining of the first half. Virtual time. Paolo Sousa to Paoletta. He was offside. And Van der Sar had no chance of knowing. In that split second, Koku into the feet of Kleibert. And now Davids. Can he repeat the feat of earlier in the game? Pinta. Here's Teixeira. Back to Sharp Pinto. out. And the cross comes in. Oh, it's off the post from Pauletta. Roy Costa off the other post. It's made it over the line. Portugal at two goals up in extra time. It's their championship to lose now. A nail biting series of events as Pauletta strikes one side of the Dutch goal post. And it's Roy Costa who follows up. Colliding with the other. And who helps it over the line but Edwin van der Sar. It's a reflex movement. Unknowingly giving Portugal extra breathing space in the final. Clive out to Bergkamp in. Here's a touch from Isaac. And the whistle's gone. Truly denied a goal scoring opportunity. Just barely offside. Portugal coming forward, looking for one more nail in the coffin and is parried away by Van der Sar. The referee has put the whistle to his dehydrated lips. He's had 120 minutes of this. It's devastation and heartbreak for Holland. The Netherlands sought out to retaste that glory they found 12 years ago in Munich against the Soviet Union. Portugal have destroyed the Dutch in their own country. And they will head into Portugal in four years' time, defending this title in Lisbon. 17 goals in six games for a flamboyant Portuguese president set here in the Netherlands and in Belgium. The co-hosts flew a fiery flag of their own over the first festival of football of the millennium. Portugal are your European champions of the year 2000. Of course, Portugal securing the European championship after extra time, four goals to two against the co-hosts. They don't go home empty-handed. Dennis Bergkamp securing the golden boot for the Netherlands with six goals ahead of a rapidly approaching Roy Costa and Nuno Gomez, Thierry Henry and also his countryman Patrick Kluivert. So for one final time, thank you very much FIFA fans. Euro 2000 was heavily requested 
A very special project is coming up for you FIFA fans, as well as an inevitable World Cup in Qatar. Thank you for watching.